but it's time to give yourself that lovely blue hammer admin. So what you need to do is select the server you want, head over to our easy config area. There's actually two ways of doing this. I'm gonna show you how to set yourself as owner, which by default will give you admin all of the time. So this is the best way to do it if there's one owner. And then I'll show you as well how to admin other people through the console. So once you get to the easy config area, you're just gonna need your Steam64 ID, which you can get it through anyways. I suggest using Steam ID IO. So it's quite good. All you need to do is enter your username and then it'll give you your Steam ID 64. Just click on copy that. Go back to our panel. And then where it says set owner ID, you replace this value with your Steam ID and then click save. Next time you restart the server, that'll give you owner, which in turn gives you admin. Obviously, if you have multiple owners or you'd like to admin people, you can also do it via console. If the user's online, you can do admin and then their name, or you can also put their Steam ID and then that'll give them admin once they're on the server. And if you have any plugins, that means they'll keep their admin throughout the restarts and stuff. It gets saved to a file.